This video will show you a comparison and the installation of the Aussie Light wheels and the Harbor Freight wheels. Um, here I'm taking the air out of the Harbor Freight wheel and I'm slipping in the 10 inch PVC. I push it all the way down to the bottom to try to make it as flat as possible so I don't get any wobble. Uh, right here I'm just putting on the spindle and making sure I've got enough clearance and got a little wobble so I just had to make some adjustments. Find where I like it and I air it up and I'm um, pretty much just air up as much as I can. So to compare the Harbor Freight wheels and the Aussie lights, I used an app called Map My Run, which gave me the speed and the distance so I could see how fast I was actually going so I could compare uh, the two separate wheels. Here I'm taking apart the Harbor Freight wheel. I'm going to change out the hub and put the Aussie light on it. And um, you know, it's going to be the same tube, just needed the uh, tire and the inner tube, just changing out the hubs. Um, here I'm taking the hubs apart. Um, I'm showing you the assembly. Um, after running it, I noticed that the bearings felt loose and they felt worn. And that's the difference between the Aussie lights and the Harbor Freight. Um, the Harbor Freight bearings are not good at all. Uh, the Aussie lights, you're paying for the, the Preston bearings and the, you know everything's all, all good to go with those. It's kind of like guaranteed. Uh, here are the bolts. You can see uh, one of them don't, don't have the lock washers on. The Aussie lights do and here's the two of them. You can see that the Aussie lights look a little beefier. Um, Two-part assembly on both of them. Those bearings are all loose on the Harbor Freight. Those are all sealed in on the Aussie lights. Uh, the problem with the Aussie lights is that that inner tube that come with the Harbor Freight are straight fitting. So yeah, I had to bore out the hole in the hub. Um, I had to do that so I'd be able to get the air fitting in so I could air up the tire. Um, that's probably the only complaint I have about these rims. These rims are, are great. I've been using them for a while and um, I, I feel a lot safer with those on, on the trike than the Harbor Freight ones. I had to put in a spacer. Um, the bolt that I used on the uh, axle was a four and a half. I should have gotten a four inch, um, but you know, I made do. So here I'm spinning them. Um, after running the test, I compared uh, five runs of the Harbor Freight and five runs with the Aussie Lights. Same speed, so really no difference, but um, you're pretty much paying for the safety, I think. Uh, the Aussie lights seem sturdier, you get less wobble, and you can notice the rim stays pretty much true. You get wobble on both of them because of the inner tube and the tires, but it's definitely worth the money for the Aussie lights. And, and uh, that's what I came up with. I hope you like the, the video, and uh, if you like it, subscribe to the channel, and I uh, hope to have some more coming soon. Thanks.